Heyo, Thallion here, and welcome back to One Shot, and we are once again in Nico's dream. Oh, you look so lonely. Oh, never mind, you're so happy. Oh, These dreams with Nico, like, really like wheat fields, and apparently- Oh, so there is an actual town. Okay, that works out decently. Hi, Nico. Jonathan, I had another dream. Did you see this one, too? Mm-hmm. I was in a big field like the one in my last dream. And I saw my village, but then I woke up. <sighs> and I, uh, I don't think this world has anything like that. I mean, big wheat fields. The only big plants I've seen are a bunch of weird trees. Yeah, the phosphor trees. And those balls of moss floating in the water. Wait, is moss even a plant? Hmm. Say, have you seen a wheat field before, Jonathan? Yeah, I have, actually. Oh, they're really pretty, aren't they? I guess I never really thought of them as pretty, but I guess they kind of are. The one around my village goes around for miles. The plants are really tall, sometimes I can't even see through them. When it's windy out, the wind uh, can make waves in it. It's like an ocean. A food! <laughs> yeah, oh, she's so cute. Oh boy, there's food in regular oceans too. Like fish or crabs. I've never actually been to a real ocean until now, actually. Um, I've been to the ocean, but I'll say me neither to make, like, Nico feel better. Oh! I guess we have that in common, Jonathan! But you're kind of seeing the ocean now, in this world anyway. As for me, I've seen them on TV before. I've never thought I'd get to ride a boat through one! Oh, she's so cute! The water back home doesn't have glowy stuff like how it is here either. Ah, uh, but I guess it's because the world is already so dark. You know, I used to be scared of the dark, Jonathan. It's a little hard to imagine that now after spending so much time here. But not long ago, I couldn't even go to sleep without a lamp. Aww. It's good you got over that? I guess. Otherwise, it wouldn't last long here. Then again, I've been carrying around the sun, so it's not that bad. And also, I don't feel scared at all with, uh, with you guiding me. Oh, Nico. So thanks for that. Oh. Oh, I won't let anything happen to you. Anyway, maybe we should head out now, Jonathan. Oh. Nico, you're so sweet. I shouldn't feel this connected. Oh, have you found something to write with? Yeah, I have. Yes, I have. Uh, let me just feather. Aha! Boom. Have you found something to write with? Oh, I can combine the feather, probably, and the bottle of dye. Oh yeah, we can use the feather as a pen. I saw it in a picture book once. It's called a quill. Feather pen. I found a pen, sort of. Indeed you do. But are you not forgetting something? Uh... Oh, the sun! Yeah, I should probably go get that. That might be slightly important to have that on me. I wouldn't want to leave that here. It, it will hurt to kind of take the sun away from Maze, though. Oh, that will make me so sad. But, I mean, I guess, like, it has to be done, because I can't just... You know, I can't just, uh... Oh, wait, that was supposed to be vined over, so that's not the way. But I can't just leave the sun here and not take it to the tower. Hey, Maze, how you doing? Oh... Oh, Maze. The, the light's gone out! Jonathan, do you know what happened? No, I have no clue. You, really? But, but, oh, what am I gonna do? Oh, the light, okay, so it starts up again when it's with you. It, it lit up again? Ooh, she's gone. Oh, there's something on the ground here. It looks like a kernel of corn? She must have left it behind. Oh, the seed. Oh. Maze. Okay, I think I can fast travel. Oh, I can't fast travel from here. But, so, okay, so clearly the light bulb needs to be connected to Nico to stay lit. Which makes me wonder, when I get to the tower, does Nico have to stay in the tower for the light bulb to give light to this world? Or does it sort of take over after a while? Because, like, we see here that Nico leaves and the light goes out after a while. So that's really suspicious. I'm not quite sure how this works. The rules of this world. And I don't think Nico really knows either how any of this works. Let me travel to the village. I want to give this seed to the person working on the crops here. I think that would be a really good idea. Because, um, talked about how the crops were kind of being hard to handle and... How they weren't really working well. Where are they? I forgot where where he is. Is he over here? Yeah, okay. Let me go ahead and give you the seed. I know you can't combine these. Let me... Boom. Here, have this seed. 
The crops have been growing poorly without the sun. There's no too long telling how long. I... I'll do my best. Can I put the seed? Oh, well, okay. I don't know what to do with this. I kind of assumed I could plant the seed when I got it from Maze. Um, from Maze's body, I guess. But I guess that's incorrect, or maybe I can plant it later. I don't know. I found a pen, sort of. Good, please write your name here. Okay, no problem. Oh, gosh, that was very, uh, very loud scribbling. Good luck! I can't remember the the, um, not the name, the, uh, the voice I gave him initially. Am I done with this area, then? Am I in a new zone? Am I climbing the tower? This isn't the tower, is it? Oh, 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 what in the world? Okay, can't go back. I, I see how this is now. I cannot go back. Oh, 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 keep moving. Just keep moving. Don't worry about the anomalies. Don't worry about the squares, as they are called. Oh, jeez, Nico. Oh, this is neat. Oh, I'm in a city. Oh, and it's all red. This is so cool. Hi. Oh, this is such a different biome than before. Oh, this is such a different environment. Oh, and I like it. It has this really mysterious feel to it. Ah, oh, the sun. Hello, Messiah. Welcome to Night Vale. Welcome to the refuge. Do you understand what you must do here? I'm supposed to go inside the tower, right? I already see the tower, so I guess we must be close. Where's the entrance? On the surface. The surface? Look down, small one. Oh, we're pretty high up. I guess I gotta go down a lot of stairs. Or find an elevator. Correct. However, the tower is a sacred place. Finding the entrance may be easy, but that alone will not be enough. What do you mean? Once you reach the surface, I recommend visiting the library for leads. All right. Thank you. Off you go. I wish you luck. Oh, that's so neat. So we have to find our way in. Um, what if I go up? Because, like, I have to go down to the surface, but what if I go up? It does also beg a question of, um... Was there supposed to be a, oh gosh, a gigantic light bulb? So what if I put the light bulb in there? Um, I never got to go into the mines. Like, I never found a vehicle. This is where I'm supposed to put the seed, but there's no dirt in this pot. Oh, okay. So, uh, this is where I'm supposed to plant things. Oh, okay, so I'll try to find some things to plant, and I'll try to remember to plant the seed. Um, I wonder if I have to plant it to complete the game, or if it's optional. Either way, I'm gonna try to plant it, give some hope to this world. Hello? Oh, this, this place is so cool. Come on! Uh, come on! Work already! Huh? What was that? I guess there's a friend for me here? There are arrows telling me where to go, but screw that. Hello. Come on. Come on. I'm too busy for this. Uh, excuse me. Whoa. I like how they add individual expressions for all the characters. You, you're... Ah, oh, jeez, I didn't think I was going to run into... This is embarrassing. Uh, is there anything I can, do, I can help you with? Yes, please. I would like to know how to get to the surface. That was a weird lag in the in the music. Yeah, I was afraid you're gonna say that. Right now, the elevator is the only way to across the surface, but yeah, just take a look at it. So it's broken. Crap. It looks like an elevator. Well, you're not wrong, but go look at the but button panel. Huh? There aren't any buttons. Yep, that's a problem. There used to be a big button here that says ground on it. You know, because it takes you to the ground area. But now it's been ripped out or something? I don't know. I tried looking everywhere for it to no avail. Maybe it exploded, because that's a thing that happens in this world. Do you think we'll have to make a new one? What? How? We'll figure it out. I'll just put, like, a piece of corn in there or something. Well, no pressure, kid. I'll just stick with my original plan for now. Time to kick the door again. I like you. Oh. <laughs> How's that working out for you? My foot hurts. <laughs> I like him. I like him a lot. Man, this place is kind of broken down. Like, there are walkways that don't lead anywhere, so it looks like this is kind of going to act as a central hub as I collect things. Um, because there are arrows leading all over the place. Oh, another bed. I'm going to save that bed for later, actually. I don't want to use it quite yet. Because I just used the other bed very recently. Hello? Anybody in here? There are anomalies blocking certain paths, I see, which means that it's gotten pretty bad in the city. 
God, this this is so pretty. The music in this game is not something I've talked about a lot, but I something I should. The music in this game is fantastic. It's really good at setting the mood, really immersing me in this world. Uh, locked, 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 not locked. Here we go. Anybody in here? A landscape painting. An abstract painting. Uh, are you an intruder? Because if you are, I, model Abel Aurora, will have to report you. Oh, sorry. I kind of just walked in because the door was unlocked. Do you want me to leave? Scanning for suspicious activity. Suspicious activities detected. Zero. Well, I guess as long as I don't do anything bad. Let me talk to the computer. It's off. Okay, I wanted to turn it on. I am still monitoring you. Oh, uh, don't worry. I promise I'll be a good guest. That's really sweet. Jonathan, someone lives here. We can't just sleep in their bed. Well, you're not wrong, Nico. I just wanted you to look at it. Oh, this is so cool. I like this. And I'm in, like, an, a dormitory. It's a wall of family photos. Oh, hi! You're quiet. <laughs> you're so quiet. Okay. Oh, you're not gonna talk to me? Oh, you seem so sad. I'm so sorry. It's a pink flower. What if I go talk to anybody up here? Oh, penguin! It's a big penguin plush. Hello, penguin. Hello. Whoa, that's creepy. Okay, let's leave. Let's actually, what happens if I talk to it again? Hello? Hello. Oh, that's so Hello. creepy. That's so creepy. Why would they put that in there? Oh, that's so creepy. I can't even handle that. Who else lives here? Um, anybody else? A painting of four robots playing cards. Hello, would you like to play a game? Oh, sure. What game would you like to play? Do you know rock, paper, scissors? Desired difficulty level, huh? Desired duration of turns, uh, please set your timer. Never mind. My parents are like literally never home, but I don't mind, I'm used to it. Besides, I got a model C2 here to keep me company. She still talks a little weird sometimes, but it's okay, she's learning. If I work really hard, she might even be tamed someday. Aw, I keep hearing that word. What, tame? Mm-hmm. Nobody told me what it means yet. That's just a robot thing, I can't really explain it either. I think it just d does mean sentience. Very interest, like interesting. So a lot of people live here. I thought I saw, yeah, there's a way out here. Oh, bathroom, not a way out, but a bathroom. A small potted plant. So there are these tiny, like, these tiny vestiges of scissors up uh, on a pile of hair. Oh, that's so weird. Um, there are these tiny vestiges of like plant life here in the city, which is interesting. And I'm happy to see it. I'm really happy to see it. But so many dormitories. Hello? Ring, ring. Ring, ring. It's a landscape portrait of the Glen, so this person must have moved from the Glen. Oh, it's a bird person! I just moved here from the Glen! Boom! I'm a psychic! Things are so different in the city. You've been to the Glen, right? Yeah! Everything's so green back there. I really miss it. My neighbor gave me some plants to cheer me up, but... oh, I should probably get a muzzle for Betsy there. <laughs> Did you eat his plants, you derp? Title says city life. What to expect? So this is all about people adjusting not only to this world, but their new surroundings. Such a very human existence. What are you- I'm not sure what this is. It looks like a little car. It's a Roomba! You should ride on it! What? Do it! Um... Woo! <laughs> you're riding the Roomba! That's so cute! Oh, Nico, you're so cute! Oh, 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 I don't mean- <laughs> Oh... Well, that was fun. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I just got an achievement that says we ride at dawn. <laughs> That's so awesome. Oh, I love this game. Oh, is this a, um, a greenhouse? <laughs> Hello there, I am Potman. You have a lot of plants. I do, grew them all myself, you see. Feel free to ask me about them. Oh, you're a gardener, right? <clears throat> yep. Do you happen to have any dirt? For growing plants, I mean. Yep. Do you need some? Yep. I, su I suppose I'm supposed to plant the seed left behind by a plant lady. But the pot in the garden doesn't have any soil. I see. I know who you're talking about, yeah. Here, take the whole bag. Thanks. Oh, that's nice. Now I can start to fill in the seed. Aw, most of the plants in our world tend to grow in the glen. Even if it's facing flooding issues, it's still in better condition than the other two areas. The Barrens is... Well, it's the Barrens. And the Refuge City is barely enough ground to stand on, let alone grow stuff. On a larger scale than this, I mean. That is a good point. Ah yes, true foliage is hard to come by nowadays. You hardly ever see trees like these in the wild anymore. And the ones you do see are pretty much all raised artificially by people like me. Man, my voice. Mostly for nostalgia purposes. 
very intriguing. So now I have stuff to help grow the plants. Does this also lead to bathrooms? Or no, this is like a big apartment. Hello, is that a coffee maker? Coffee cups, I'm too young to drink coffee. No, you're not. Drink coffee from a young age. It doesn't stunt your growth or nothing, you'll be fine. Ooh, what is this, stickers? The fridge has so many magnets on it. Maybe they'll come in handy. I hope nobody will mind us taking them. You just stole somebody's fridge magnets, you dirty, rotten thief. Oh, hi. Hello. Hey there. Hello. You the messiah? Mm-hmm. I like your scarf. Oh, thank you. Mama made it for me. Tell her I like her needlework. I will, when I see her again. Hey there. Oh, okay, so this is just repeating that. I like that, though. That was so kind. So randomly kind. It looks like I can unlatch this door. Um, oh, and that must create a shortcut. Okay. That just creates a shortcut between here and the other part. Well, that's one area that I've actually managed to, like, finish exploring. So I guess I'll leave this episode here. And the next episode, I'll explore these right areas over here. And hopefully get whatever else I need to plant a seed. Um, maybe the dirt alone will be enough, but I imagine I'll have to have water of some sort. Which I have this tube of water. So that'll probably be fine. But anyways, thank you everybody for watching. If you like this video, please hit that like button. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Valiant out! Nico the Garden Cat.